Hello, my name is Keshwani. That's K E S H W A N I Keshwani. We are here because we want to prepare for the GMAT. We have been solving math problems out of this book here, the GMAT Review 2015. If you do not own this book already, purchase one immediately. You're going to need it. One more time, the official guide GMAT Review 2015. It just so happens, it just so happens that the, all the math problems that are appearing in 2015 editions are exactly the same problems as the ones that appeared in the 13th edition of GMAT. We have already solved every single math problem from the 13th edition. I'm not going to redo them. I'm going to simply tell you where to find a solution to a given problem. Let's begin, shall we? We'll begin our work from page number 175. 175 and 176 is what we're going to look at. On page 175, you will find the solutions to problem number 161 and 162 on day number 331. On the same page, page number 175, you will find the solutions to problem number 163, 164, and 165 on the next day, day 333. The reason I say next day is because you will see the solutions to all the problem solving questions are presented on odd days and solutions to all the data sufficiency questions are presented on even days beginning with 252. You will find the solutions to all the problems from day number 251 through 375. Let's continue. Again, on page number 175, solutions to problem number 166 was presented on day number 335. You will find the solutions to problem number 167, 168, and 169 on the next page, page number 176, on day number 337. And again on the same page, solutions to problem number 170 and 171, you will find on day number 339. Thank you.